Hi and welcome to creating a retro illustration in Adobe Illustrator. My name is Ioana Shapov and together we're going to be working our way through a vector illustration from concept to finished product. A lot of people are put off by the crispy sharp perfection of vector shapes, but a vector illustration doesn't have to be that way all the time. You can create interesting details and textures just by using Illustrator's amazing brushes and effects and in this course, you'll see how that can be done without too much effort. We're going to take a comparative look at sketching in Photoshop versus Illustrator, then I'll show you a basic technique of coming up with concepts for your illustration and my preferred sketching process. After that, we're going to import our sketch into Illustrator and start tracing our sketch using the Pathfinder tool to save time, creating distressed art brushes directly in Illustrator, and adding details to our illustration. I'm going to be working in Photoshop and Illustrator CS6, so you're going to need at least the CS5 versions. While you can work on the vector part of the process with just a mouse, I recommend using a Wacom tablet such as an Intuos or an Intuos Pro, especially useful in the sketching part of the process. The Source Files folder contains my sketch as well as the color swatch I used for my illustrations, so that if you want, you can work directly on the sketch that I'll be working on. So without any further delay, when you're ready, join me in Chapter 2, in which we'll start off by talking about concepting and sketching for our illustration.